Today we're going to make some iced lollies. At the moment the weather's really warm, so I just think it would be a really good thing to do. They cost pennies as well, and you can use lots of different juices, flavourings, you can use some squash diluted, you can use coke, lemonade, anything you want really. So I'm using these old fashioned pop bags which I got from eBay and I'll open one up ready to use. I'm also going to do some flavoured ice cubes. These are really good when you're doing something like a punch or a refreshing fruit juice. You could probably also use them in cocktails, um, like, like pims or champagne, or even in a jug of water. This one is a tropical juice. These I bought on offer, three for three pounds, from Iceland. Give it a shake. Pour them into a jug. Um, what I'm going to do, instead of putting it in meat, because that can be quite acidic on the stomach, I'm going to add some water to make it up to about a pint, and that makes it then more refreshing probably, and, and diluted. I've put the funnel in. And then pour some of the juice in. I want about halfway up like that. I'm going to remove the funnel. And I've got here some frozen berries. These are tea berries from our garden. We haven't used any chemicals on them at all, so they're natural. I'm going to force one or two of these into the plastic bag. No rude comments, these bags do look like condoms, but I've said about that the better. And then we're just going to top that up slightly. Just a little. And there should be enough at the end there to make a knot in it. Again, no comments, no rude comments. Make a knot in it. <laughs> and we carry on like that with all of them. And you see we've got some berries in there. And that's really nice and refreshing on a hot day. When you want to eat it, all you have to do is just snip the top and then pull it back. Now, the next thing is I'm going to use some of this to just fill a nice cube tray. Like that. And then we're going to do another flavour. We'll finish that off in a minute. I'm going to use some of this apple and black currant. This is no added sugar. I'm going to pour some of this in a cup and again dilute it. Right. And then put the end of the funnel in the bag as before. And again fill it halfway up. Obviously it's easy if you've got something else to pour that half full. And again, put in a few of the tea berries. That's three. And then add a tiny drop more. And then 
do all the bag as before. So not the end as before. And there you go, another lolly. And now we can add a drop to the ice cube tray. Until the tray is full. And you just continue bagging up until they're all done. You can also use um, yogurt, little yoghurt cartons and lolly sticks or you can get lolly moulds from Asda George for about £3 online. You can also make plain orange ones as well or plain tropical ones or apple ones, whatever you like, just plain. You don't have to put berries in if you don't have them. As I said, these cost pence. And there we are, nice lollies to enjoy on a hot summer's day.